life's when I'ma stop hustling I told her no time soon, long as this pot's bubbling And I don't touch it if I can't make a profit of it Hustling, should move the island how I love Dublin Mama forgive me, your baby boy outside thugging She know ain't no pussy in me, I came out of stomach Kid, fly like Vada You already know what it is, man, it's your boy Vada Fly Tell your mama I said hi, tell your sister I missed her Got my guy in the building with me Showtime SP to nobody that knows bodies bip, 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 bip. So check it out, man. Um, what, what's what you up to, man? How's your What's weekend going? You know what I'm saying? What's new? What's the word, man? You know what I'm saying? I gotta ask you that more often. Look, man, nah, man. I'm, I'm good over here. You know what I mean? I can't complain too much. The weekend was real chill. No battle rap this weekend. Mm -hmm. it felt a little mm -hmm. off, but you know, I had to get to the, you know, get to the fame. Of course, I had to do some work. What about you? What you do? Chilling, this weekend? man. I've been chilling, man. You know, just was just chilling, cruising, mm -hmm. chilling. You know what I'm saying? Um, not a lot of battle rap events on. I wasn't really engaged with like everything that was going on Twitter. I seen Twitter was, Twitter was up there. You know yeah, what I mean? Like the battle rap, rap Twitter, the shenanigans. Yeah. Um, with Verb and Hitman, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Like I said, Verb has some of the weirdest promo. I don't know if this is promotion. I don't know what it is. I just I dip in. I listen to about five, six minutes of the of the space, and I get up out of there. Yeah. Um, <laughs> it looks like, uh, cause you know, here's the thing. I seen Hitman. And Geechee going back and forth. You know what I'm saying, uh, let me, let me, let me take you back. You know what I'm saying. Even though I wasn't there, whenever I see some, some random, some, some, some fuckery, <laughs> I'll just, uh, I'll snap it and save it. You know As what I'm saying? Because uh, I know I'm gonna talk to you sooner or later. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna see my mm -hmm. boy. Mm -hmm. We're gonna run it back. Wine. You know what I'm saying? A uh, nice shirt, by the way. Appreciate that. Uh, so I seen uh, <laughs> Geechee Gotti saying Hitman can perform in battle rap. Niggas don't feel holler, and they get the feel. They watch holler and say that boy got moves. Me versus him is like comparing Amarion to Luther Vandross. It's just a different feeling. Luther don't need to spin moves. Let me hold you tight. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? He don't. Luther didn't dance. You know what I'm saying? Luther was just up there doing his one too. So then uh, I see Hitman's tweet. They was together. You know the algorithm be algorithm and shit. And Hitman said, "I'm smacking because when I see him, and I ain't smack and I ain't said nobody could do. Y'all could cry. Y'all want? I don't lose no sleep at night. Saying basically he was gonna slap somebody when he saw him." Then Geechee said, Hitman a clown. That's y'all who believe him. I keep telling the culture, y'all let anybody act tough. The same person who can't run into a nigga from the same city as him, he never stopped performing, I guess. Mm. You know what I mean? Mm. That's what I'm saying. I mean, the back and forth uh, is nah, we, I wanna, let's, let's put it out there. So he said, another person says, I, didn't, I think Briz signed the contract for Hitman. I just don't know the league name. Briz, um, Hitman said, Briz scary ass ducked me a few times, tell him to stay, stay in that undisclosed location he been at. Briz says, no, I just wanted the mook battle. Uh whoop -de -whoop -de -whoop. It never happened, so what am I reading it for? No, uh, he said he said Mook was a bigger draw than you. That's what he said. That's he what said Briz that. said. Briz. I, you know, sometimes I saw like, that. My uh my 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 mental level to be ready to accept dumb shit is at a low. So when I be seeing it, I just read like the first two, three words and I just move on, yeah, you know what I'm yeah. saying? <laughs> but uh, here we have, what it's led to now mm -hmm. is a battle being announced. I knew a battle was being announced because these niggas don't promote for free, you know what I'm saying? Like why are they up here promoting this heavy and going back and forth? Hitman drops a flyer, November 9th, ATL, we'll see Hitman. Holler vs. Gishi Gotti, Power Moves, Bags and Bodies presents at the Cover Sports and Shows ATL 4110 Memorial Drive, Decatur, Georgia, mm. November 9th. Doors open at 1 p.m. Battle start at 3. So doors open at 1. Battle start around 4 or 5. You know, nigga time. You know what I'm saying? Um, and it says on pay-per-view, Rap Grid, $50 pay-per-view. Bags and bodies, Hitman House. It looks like Hitman House putting together his own event, which was probably what he was trying to battle Mook on. That's the first thing I thought. Um, give me your thoughts. I just want you to you know, tell me what you think and we'll go from there. Well, I mean, the conversation itself, yeah, you're right. I saw that back and forth, so a, a battle had to be brewing. We had to just figure out where was it going to be. Right. It didn't seem like it was going to be on URL because mm -hmm. they said that the money the money's the going money to, not coming money back, not coming son. Back, son. Yeah. So, you know what I'm saying? ARP and RBE are, are doing well, but they they said that that ain't on That money radar. ain't coming back <laughs> either, son. Yeah, I mean, look, look, look. King of the Dot just did a two day event. They usually be like, they usually drop like every what every uh, uh season, every new season. That's yeah, the actually, King of the Dot. King of the Dot actually has an event coming up uh in November, you know what I'm saying? That's what's and, up, Nova Scotia for past day. Oh, okay. uh, I don't have all the information yet, but I do know a battle or two. And if it's going the way it's supposed to be going, that's gonna be fire. But let's get back to this. That's what's up. So we got Massacre Six that was in the summertime. So then you're gonna get your fall battle, you know what I'm saying? We'll see them in the springtime now. Uh, <laughs> what it is, it no, not the fall winter. So what it is is, you really gotta look at it on the standpoint of okay, where is this battle going down? ACL. It is going down 
in ATL, but it is going down on Hitman Holler's lead. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying this is a setup, but I'm saying it's a rendezvous that has been um, acquired and your attendance is needed, Geechee Gotti. Hitman Holler said, you know what, let me do it on my own platform. I don't like that. I'm going to tell you why I don't like that for one reason and one reason only. You are turning the tide against me. And for Geechee Gotti, the tide is already against him as of right now. I don't think that uh, Hitman Holla has a competitive advantage even in Atlanta because, number one, he's not from there. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know he lives there. Being where you live and where you're from is two different things. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And Geechee Gotti is... Um, he's like Visa. You know what I'm saying? He's globally and locally accepted. Mm. So he can battle pretty much anywhere he wants. And I don't feel like he has a distinct... A competitive disadvantage, you know what I'm saying? But here's the thing about Geechee Gotti. Mm -hmm. Geechee Gotti. Geechee Gotti, as of late, has been known to mail in battles, you know what I'm saying? There's a couple battles that he's mailed in, you know what I mean? Stamp, envelope, good. But the crazy part is we know you're so talented mm -hmm. that when this shit happens, we don't get super fucked up about it mm -hmm. because we know the talent is there, but now you're battling against Hitman Holly. He just mailed in the battle versus Mar 1, like, Three to five business days ago. Yes, the reason why. Mm -hmm. I think what he mailed in to Charlie. He mailed a couple battles. He mailed in freestyling and shit like he's, that. He's kind of been freestyling. So, mm -hmm. uh, does Geechee Gotti have the ability to perform mm -hmm. at a high level whenever called? Yeah, he does. You know yeah. what I'm saying? He'll show up for this. I have no doubt he's gonna show up for this battle. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Because one thing I know about MCs, mm -hmm. they don't play when they get certain motherfuckers. Nigga get Geechee, they not playing. Nigga get Mook, they not playing. Nigga get Rock, they not playing. Right. Motherfucker get Surf, they not playing. Most of the time, JC was. But most of the time, I'm saying when a nigga get somebody, they don't be he playing did. around. He was dead. Um, yeah, they gonna come and they gonna show up and perform. Um, but mm -hmm. the, you know what I'm saying? Hitman Hollis putting the thing together. Here's the thing, you know, and, and there's no knock on Hitman. I will say that there are some important things that go into events. Obviously, the rest of the card is gonna be important. Whoever's on there, clone. Mm -hmm. What's, what's up? Mm -hmm. Can we get clone in Atlanta? That nigga been from Atlanta. He be cooking shit all year. Clone mm -hmm. deserves to be, you know what I'm saying? Or whatever situations is going on mm -hmm. in Atlanta right now. Um, but I like the battle overall. I do. I do like it, and I think it's one that should have been happening. It's a legacy uh, imprint battle for. Um, Geechee Gotti, mm -hmm. uh, Hitman Holla's been looking like you know a pit bull ready to get off the leash and then bark and, and get into a and get into a dog fight. Mm -hmm. uh, I've seen Hitman Holla battle in the smaller rooms before. Obviously Cortez back in the day and Bill Collector, you know, I got Tommy with the white like the Green Ranger. I thought that was fine. When you start rapping like that, nigga, I don't know. Max what's out, up? Max out four. Versus Max out. Little. Yeah, what's up? So what's up? Talk to me. Listen, man, I'm gonna put it to you like this. I like how you set that present. That that, that was that was good. You I ain't seen you a couple days. You it's all good. And I'm, I, I, as usual, you know, you know how to lay the foreground. Yeah. But the reason why you call me over here is to be honest and keep it all the way 100. Let's keep it all the way tall. Nah, Go. we glazing over the mail in Geechee. Go. Did not. Nah, it's it's we know the stumbling Geechee. We know the yeah yeah. Nah, I'm saying. Nah, and I'm gonna say that line again because that nigga ain't hear what I said again. Yeah, yeah. I'm not. No, this is not what we need. So, for yeah, Geechee yeah, Gotti. Yeah, for you Geechee bitch Gotti. made the click spray. Mm -hmm. What you know about getting shot and you still gotta go to work because you ain't got no more sick days? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Like, nigga, I don't need that. I need straight. I need all that. that. Type of shit. Now, point, now, point number one. Yes, we just saw that Marv 1 battle, and Marv 1 cooked you. I ain't gonna say that he smoked you all three rounds, because Marv 1 messed up in the second, but at the same time... It was post when it was close to. Hey, it, it was... You, go. you know what I'm saying? Look, it was a win for Marv. What was the outcome of that battle? Marv 1. Yo. So, what I'm saying here for you, Geechee, your next battle is Miss Hustle. So, Miss Hustle is September 14th. So, from September 14th, you lay it all on the line. I better not hear not one battle set up. I don't want to hear about no 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 meetings, no uh, no no bar, no parties. I don't want you hosting nothing. Maybe the no studio one is fine. If we saying the only time we know Geechee going to be locked in is for Hitman Holler, now we got the battle actually happen. Geechee, I need you to actually deliver. Mm -hmm. Problem is... Hitman Holla has been doubted for these past couple of battles. Hitman Holla has been looking a lot human, especially nowadays that he's getting more of that the the, uh, the the tweeting and the posting of the videos. We are now seeing Hitman Holla in a different light. We see him as a hothead. We see him as somebody who's going to get passionately bothered when it comes to a uh, very minuscule situation. So you see that I took your book, I, I took the book and I and I was reading it. But for minute for the for the small situations or the occurrences that automatically makes Hitman holler boy what is going to make this battle get sold for me I need to see a face off for sure I gotta see a face off even though his bags and bodies and this uh, uh, don't matter where it is on the totem pole it is still Hitman Holler's league even though I do feel it is a home game advantage oh yeah, yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying because it's his league 
Hey man, Holly, you are now also on the clock for league owners having the main event and yet still have to run a whole event. Have we ever seen the Bags and Bodies live event? No. No. Okay. It's the only thing that we know is that the season one of Bags and Bodies happened. Season two was recorded. There is a winner. We don't know who it is and we haven't seen it. For sure. But when it comes to productivity and production on Hitman Holla's side, if it ain't you know, the, the, the big money side, we, we gonna get something lackluster. I feel like for a battle of this magnitude, it needs to be taken care of properly. Hitman, put the right people in place so that the only thing you need to do is focus on killing Geechee Gotti right now. And I'm gonna say this and I'm gonna get on out of here. Right now, it seems like Geechee Gotti is, is in that, that Mortal Kombat stage when it says finish him and he's just sitting here like this. And he just said, it's up to you to do a full fatality or you just gonna duck and punch your way out of that. Or if you do mercy. Mercy is what happens is if you duck three times, all of a sudden the person that comes out of finish him, you give him another chance. Oh, really, this could be your mercy battle, Gigi Gotti. Smoking Hitman Holla now puts you on the list of the greatest of all times because then you can say he beat Loaded Lux. He, uh, 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 wait, he beat Loaded Lux and now he beat Hitman Holla? I can do a lot for him. <sighs> Uh, here's the deal, you know what I'm saying? Uh, the stream is gonna be important. It's gonna be on Rap Grid. Just hire Avocado. Just, 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 just it, it works way better. Do not ruin um, your day for that. Battle. Um, you know, like I said, I am happy to see Hitman stepping into this entrepreneurship role and getting mm -hmm. a event going. Uh, because, like I said, this year in battle rap to me has been one of the slowest. Like down year, it's not a lot of big events. It's not a lot of premier events going on. I mean, there's an event or two that happened, but mm -hmm. I can't name. Every year, normally, it'd be a lot of other leagues having events, smaller leagues mm -hmm. having events, a lot of cards coming, a lot of pay-per-views. Yeah. There may be another pay-per-view or two or three this year, you know what I mean? Like, with yeah. big names and big matchups. Correct. But, uh, actually going into the battle, like I said, when prepared, win on 100, Gichi Gotti is one of them guys, you know what I'm saying? Like, he's known, he can show up, he can bring, he's, he showed up to big battles before. Mm -hmm. And you know, he's had requisite material, he's got two and a half months. I don't doubt what he's able to do. But then there's Hitman, you know what I'm saying? He's gonna be trying to not only make a name, he's gonna be trying to have a show because when you set up the battle, mm -hmm. your name is on the flyer, you got the event. So on top of the card. You building the rest of the card, mm -hmm. you can't show up and get smoked. You know what I'm saying? Because it's like, damn, what's all this for? You know what I'm saying? So what do you think as far as with the battle? Like, what's up? If we talking about actual style-wise, I mean, of course, you know, the closer the battle gets, we can definitely go down the tail of the tape. But if we talking about a blanket statement, let's just lay it all out there on the line. We got performance versus bars. But the question is, who's going to have the better performance and who's going to have the better bars? We don't see Geechee Gotti dancing on the nigga. We don't see him spinning around doing all of the jumping up and yeah. down. You don't see that from Geechee. It's the believability and the conviction. Mm -hmm. Problem is, Hitman Holla has went against, went up against those type of things. To quote Free to Wave, Sue Surf, we seen monsters before. Mm, fire. For Hitman Holla to be like, hey, I'm standing against a nigga that just yelled at me, for, uh, talk about how gangster I am, nigga, do I gotta show you? Yeah. He don't need to do that, but at the same time, for Hitman Holla, the bars is gonna have to make sense. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? How many, because Geechee is a veteran at this point, mm -hmm. how many Geechee Gotti flips you gonna have, Hitman? How many bars are you gonna have that's catered directly towards Geechee Gotti? Mm -hmm. Right now, I'm saying it could go 2 1 either way because it's a style clash at this point. Mm -hmm. Performance is gonna outweigh. I'm sorry, the performance can only last as long as the bars are there. Mm -hmm. For Geechee, the conviction is there, and remember, we seen him mail in battles, and he be getting slight, yeah. slight wins. True, still be getting slight wins. So, sinus. Oh yeah, no, you good. Uh, I thought what I was saying was beautiful. It you was making me cry. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I shed a tear for, your, for your dynamic monologue. You know what I'm Keep going. You nah, I feel you. But <laughs> you still did. Yeah. Uh, so dynamic. What, what you got? What you got right now is a style clash because it is performance versus the bars and the conviction. Mm -hmm. This also has a fight that's brewing right now because, of course, you know the gang bang thing. That is a mm -hmm. thing. One yeah, reps bloody yeah, block, yeah, one yeah, reps blood. Yeah, Very hard. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Now we gotta. Now we, this is the, the battle itself. If we just keep it in that in that 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 snow globe. And just shake it up, it can look amazing. But if that snow globe crack over and it's, and it's outside of battle rap, 
Yeah. I mean, they both got specific angles that they can utilize, you know what I'm saying? You got hit man with the whole, you know, I'm a boss, you had to battle me on my league type shit, you know what I'm saying? You got your own league while we had to battle, you know what I'm saying? He got that type mm -hmm. of angle. Then Geechee's got the, you know, I'm from LA, I'm a crib, you're a blood, mm -hmm. you're not from here. You know what I'm saying? I already know that those mm -hmm. are glaring uh, angles that can be used. I do hope that even though Geechee Gotti, while hearing and seeing all of the shit that Verb is lamenting online every day, does not feed too much into that shit yeah. because it's like, I feel like Geechee Gotti has the ability to battle, win, and do good versus Hitman without all of the extra, yo, did you hear? Um, Verb's mom used to work at the supermarket and mm. he got fired because he was stealing gross. I don't care about all that type of shit. Like for me, I'm more so battle rap, battle rap. I just want to see a battle, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, don't, I don't feed into all the extra Agreed. shit. What's up? I do, I, for for Geechee, I think the, the, the first thing I'm saying out the gate is we got Geechee Gotti versus Nigga, how the fuck you and another nigga is in the same area, but both at the same stop sign, but nobody was there for nothing. Like I would have said something like that in a in a better rhyming pattern. But you get what I'm saying? Like it's what it. He, he brought that nigga out. You know what I'm saying? Like he brought that. I would have said, listen, he either gonna bring out Byron Blake or he gonna bring out Verb. Either way, he gonna bring out somebody that's gonna switch the tides. You know what I'm saying? And if we haven't know, if we haven't learned from the the, the Tay Rock and the Big K battle, sometimes moments can win the battle versus having a bunch of material. And therefore, it can go right back into Hitman Holla's hands. Come I seen a poll, it's like got it, one poll that I saw had Hitman like 53 or 54 and then Geechee like 47, you yeah, know what I'm saying? that's and close, that's I pretty think close. That is, and you know what I'm saying, whatever. So I think the competitive advantage is uh, to Hitman, because it's his league, his platform, he's gonna have his setup, his cameraman, mm -hmm. uh, his cousin is cooking wings and shit, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So when you walk into one of those situations, it's always more comfortable for you. Yeah. But then at the same time, Geechee Gotti is one of those, I can go to a league anywhere and be a, and be a top level MC, you know what I'm saying? I think that when it comes to Gotti, you know what I'm saying, salute to him and all he's got going on, Lumen Gotti albums out and everything. Facts. Um, I think when it comes to him, that ability to have to perform at the top level every single time when people don't see it, it makes people start to question it. Like, yo, will he mail this one in? Will he mail mm -hmm. that one in? I know him well enough to know that a battle versus Hitman Holler is the battle that he's not gonna play with, you know what I'm saying? So. At all. Like, I mean, when you got Hitman Holler, uh, I don't think nobody, and I don't, I don't recall. Cause you don't get a Hitman battle. Yeah, anymore. I'm about to say like, you don't, there, there's names like you you know not to play around with. When you hear uh, Hitman Holler, when you hear Murder Mook, when you hear Loaded Lux, you you not you know not to play around with those guys. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, the uh, the guard has to get changed. The, like somebody has to pass it down. So, you know, Gichi Gotti is one of the god killers. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? So, for this being a monumental battle, I I, I can see Gichi Gotti coming out of here with uh with King Arthur sword for sure. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Cause don't. Dope, 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 look, dope battle, you know what I'm saying? We'll see where it goes from there, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to Hitman Holla. Shout out to Geechee Gotti. Exactly. You already know what the fuck going on. Keep your money long. Rah. Got my mama bad ex, but I'ma stop hustling. I told her no time soon, long as this pot's bubbling. And I don't touch it if I can't make a profit of it. Hustling, should move the island how I love Dublin. Mama, forgive me, your baby boy outside thugging. She know ain't no pussy in me, I came out of stomach. Kid, fly like Vada.